Hi, I'm Mia. Um, I got an award for dance. I started dancing when I was five. Kasi bunso ako sa family. So pagka summer, lahat ng pinsan ko magagaling sila sa ballet school. And then uuwi sila. Tapos they would show me what, what they learned from class. And then there was this one day when they arrived, I was running towards them. Tapos na trip ako sa own feet ko kasi piki ako sobra. So uh, when my grandma saw this, ano, sabi niya, dito ka nga, um, tas tinaw niya mga pinsan ko, turuan niyo nga siya, mga first position, second, ganyan. And then, when they saw na I could catch up well, they enrolled me to the same ballet school. And then yun na, since then, I never stopped dancing. Oh, well, I stopped for a year, pero hindi ko naman siya gusto nung nung I stopped. I'd rather perform in front of an audience na I know, I do not know anyone. Kasi parang kapag nandun, I can just do my own thing, I can just dance, tapos parang no judgments talaga. Kasi ako, ano naman eh, um, I dance to express. Um, I don't dance for other people as much as possible. Pero when I dance kasi here in Ateneo, yung feeling ko is people are watching me, people are thinking na, ah okay, so ganito pala siya sumayaw, ganun. Ayoko yun eh. So I become more conscious, so medyo mas... Um, kumbaga mas pigil yung movements ko but then when I have performances or recitals outside for example in CCP or in Meralco Theater talaga I dance my heart out talaga the thing is yung supposedly best performance ko hindi ko siya natuloy um, I was in third year high school then um, so kasi ano pa lang ako nun eh uh, level 3 Level 3. So, meron akong seniors. Yung seniors ko, sila yung soloista, ganyan. Tapos, may dumating na choreographer. And then, what she did was, she surprised me because she got me as the, as the star of this um, long dance. Mga 7-minute long na, perform, na number. And then, I was, I was the star. I was the one in the middle. I would dance first before everyone else would. So, there. So, I, we were practicing. And I was really excited for the dance. I, I invited my family. I, I told my friends already about it. And then, the week before the actual performance, I injured myself. So, I dislocated my right knee. Ayun. So, it was really, really heartbreaking then. Because I was, I was really set in performing already. But this will be my big break. After this, people will know me. Um, my, I, I will gain the trust of my dance teacher. Ganyan. But then yun nga, I got injured. Tapos the sad thing was, after I got injured, so I took therapy, and then I went back to dancing, and then I got injured again. So yun. So um, after noon, uh, the, the, my doctor told me na I couldn't dance anymore kasi I would be really prone to injuries afterwards na. And then I said, I, I asked him, meron pa ba tayong ibang pwedeng magawa? Kasi sabi niya, well, pwede, ka na, pwede natin ikaw mag-undergo ng surgery. Pwede ka namin lagyan ng screw sa paa para wag nang madidislocate yung knee mo. Kasi sabi ko, okay, ganyan. So parang, actually, alam ko masama yung love sa akin ng family ko nun. Kasi sabi, kasi sabi nila, hindi tayo mag-vacation ngayong summer kasi yung mahal-mahal niyang tuhod mo. Ganyan, all because you wanna dance. So yun, so I underwent surgery, tapos after, again, after therapy, ayun, nakabalik na ako. And hanggang ngayon, okay na ako ulit, nagda-dance na ako ulit. Basta kasi kahit anong stress na ma-experience ko, nililook forward ko after a long week, kahit short week or anything, meron akong sayaw pagdating ng weekend. Kunwari, good week ako, I wanna celebrate, I wanna dance. Kung bad week ako, I wanna, I wanna change my mood, I wanna dance. So actually, siguro kasi... 16 years na eh. So, mula bata ako hanggang pagtanda ko, I've been dancing. So, kasama lang siya na talaga. Parang, hindi ko na kailangan ng motivation. Ando na lang siya talaga.